Hi. This is conversation with Yahweh. My name is Emily D. Stay tuned and be blessed. Where is your crown? Where is your crown? Are you sure that your crown is still on your head? Are you sure that your crown is still where you kept it? If it is not already on your head? Are you sure that you have been protecting your crown so that it is not stolen? Oh yeah. I see that most of you have been protecting your crown wherever it is. I see that some of you, your crowns are on your heads. But some of you, your crown has been gambled with. They have gambled with your crown to make sure that they steal your power away from you. They gambled with your crown to mess with your territory. They gambled with your crown to kick you off your throne. But I am here to restore you and place your crown right back on your head where it belongs. And as I do this now, you shall see to it that you protect such crown. It is an invisible crown. As some of you might say, where is the crown? It is an invisible crown. A divine crown that was given to you during your moment of upgrade, your moment of promotion. As the heaven joins together with the host of the earth and decorated you with this crown. You are not aware that a crown was placed on your head and a charge was put on you to protect this crown. But just because you do not see this crown You thought that nothing was given to you. But I am here to remind you. Of, or if you did not know, I am here. To inform you. That a crown was placed on your head. And you were given the charge to protect that crown. It is not an ordinary crown. It is a crown of dignity. A crown of royalty. A crown of grace, a crown of authority, or of higher position. But because you are ignorant about this crown, it was gambled over. It was stolen. It was some of you, your crowns were destroyed. But I am here to restore you and restore you in full. Because I have upgraded you and have given you the spiritual understanding. Of what that crown is all about. <laughs> you have been upgraded. And your crown has been restored. Your crown is over your head. See to it that you protect it. And you protect your crown by recognizing its existence. Because you do not see, it doesn't mean that it doesn't exist. <laughs> you needed your crown. 
but you did not know that you needed that crown. That crown was not being was not being given to you for fancy. It was not being given to you to decorate, just to decorate you. But it was given to you as a symbol of authority in Christ. It was given to you as a symbol of dignity. It was given to you to award you for a job well done in the kingdom. The crown is right back on your head. They stole the crown and sold the crown for a few pieces of silver. Those that had eyes saw the crown. It was so beautiful. It is so beautiful. And some of you, they got jealous of you. They didn't steal the crown. They destroyed the crown. And some of you, they blinded you from seeing that crown. But you shall see the crown. Even now as I speak, that is the crown on your head. Can you feel the crown on your head? Can you see that beautiful crown on your head? How does it look like? How does it feel to wear such a beautiful crown on your head? A divine crown. No one shall steal it. No one shall destroy it anymore. It has come back to your head to exist for eternity. Protect your crown now. Because with your crown, I connect to you. With your crown, you receive from me. With your crown on your head, you are respected both in the physical and the spiritual. With your crown on your head, you recognize who you are in the spirit and in the physical. With that crown on your head, you are seen as a true royal priesthood that you are. With that crown on your head, you are given the honor that you deserve, both spiritually and physically. And as you see that crown on your head spiritually, so shall you be honored physically, even without anyone seeing the crown on your head. You were being neglected, disgraced, insulted, persecuted, rejected because you were empty. There was no crown on your head. Your crown was taken away. But now that your crown has been restored on your head, you shall see changes in your life. You shall be able to see the connection that you needed to see. When it comes to you and I, you shall see the approaches of those around you differently. You shall begin to understand the things that you could not understand before. You shall begin to see the things that you could not see before. You shall begin to speak the things you could not speak before. Your heart shall be filled with compassion, with grace. Your strength restored. The light of God activated in you. The creativity of God activated in you. Even as you stand strong in your purpose and in your calling at a time such as this. The crown is back on your head. The crown is back to stay and to stay forever and ever and ever and ever. Declares the Lord of hosts.